We are going to be focusing the majority of this video specifically on running ads with Google. Google has a massive advertising ecosystem. It's a great place to start generating paid traffic to your store. Before we get started, if you haven't watched our video on SEO, I highly recommend going to watch that video. Running ads works best when you have a good handle on properly optimizing your store to be found by search engines. So why are we focusing this video on Google? Well, it's simple. Google holds about 70% of the search engine market share. That means that most people use Google to find things on the internet. So if you wanna get the most out of your time and money, it's a good place to start. Google actually splits its advertising into two groups, the Google Search Network and the Google Display Network. The Google Search Network mainly focuses on, you guessed it, results from their search engine, whether it's on the main search results page or one of the tabs, on that page. The Google Display Network is pretty much anywhere else. So let's take a look at an example of this with the Google free listings. Now it does say free in the name and you might be wondering why we didn't go over this in the free traffic video. And that's because, well, we'll get into it. If you haven't noticed this by now, one of the search result tabs on a Google search is shopping. If you want a nice blue shirt, you can just type in blue shirt, click on the shopping tab and it will bring you products that you can buy. As the name suggests, Google has made it free to list products from your store in this tab. You just need to set up a free Google marketing account. What that means for you and your store is that you can tell Google exactly what products you want listed to come up on that tab. You just have to go into the Google marketing account and list all of those products you want to show up in the tab. The catch is you got to do it manually. Like I said, it's free and a great way to get traffic into your funnel, but it's a lot of work to do manually entering every product you want to show up in there, or it can be, but there is an easier way. On the Equit App Store are some apps that will simplify this process for you, making it very easy. But this is where the money comes in. For example, we have a very helpful app called Clickin. Clickin can actually automate the entire process of listing all of the products on your store onto Google Free Listings. It's actually specifically designed for us to help you do that very thing. And it can even help you do it across multiple platforms. Normally this process through Google can be very time consuming. Thankfully, we have provided you with the ability to manage any Google ad campaigns, free or otherwise, directly in your store control panel, all powered by Clickin. There are many options depending on your marketing needs, so be sure to visit the information to learn more. Next, we're gonna talk about Google Shopping ads because paying for ads is the logical next step. This will open your store to a whole new level of reach. And again, if you're feeling apprehensive about this, this is another place that Clickin can help out. Starting in that shopping tab we talked about, you might notice that the top level is sponsored. This is a spot that stores have paid Google to get their product results listed in the very top row. Being among the first results listed is a huge deal, but it doesn't just stop with the results page on their search engine. The second way that Google lists ads is through the Google Display Network. You might think of Google as a search engine, but they haven't just been a search engine for a long time, and their ads take full advantage of their various platforms. Think about all the times that you have seen a Google ad as you browse the internet. For instance, any ad you watch on YouTube? Google ad. You see an ad on Gmail? Google ad. You see an ad in Google Maps? Google ad. These ads not only show up on their web pages, but also in their respective apps. The Google Display Network is a collection of more than 2 million web pages that have partnered with Google to display their ads. You'll notice these when you see products labeled as sponsored or ads or ads by Google. It's not, it's not really hidden. And that actually leads me to a great tip. As tempting as it might be, don't go searching for your ads. I know you want to. This will actually adversely affect your metrics for your ads. It throws off the reach, it throws off the impressions, and it definitely throws off the click-through rates, and you don't want that. If you wanna know more about those, we talk about them in the conversion funnel video. Go check that out. So if you're ready for the next step, if you're ready to spend money, I recommend checking out a few articles listed in the information, and also get your products listed on Google Free Listings. You'll find a lot of help under marketing and your store control panel. Just navigate to Google Ads and get started. 